Hi everybody, it's Nani. How you doing today? I'm doing great. I am back with a massive Christmas Dollar Tree haul. I was gonna kind of incorporate these into other hauls and everything, but I had so much that I had picked up. I figured I'm just gonna gather it all up and put it all together in one haul for you. So I'm just gonna start with what I showed in my thumbnail. They are the metal rings for the little Christmas trees that they have. I think they are adorable. They are the gal these are the galvanized. I believe they also have them in a solid red that maybe says Merry just Merry Christmas. These say farm fresh Christmas trees. Christmas tree on it. And I think they are just so nice. That is crazy what Dollar Tree is coming out with. With these, you just put your little, the Dollar Tree Christmas tree in there, put this around the bottom. So cute. I don't even know what they call these. What do they call them? It's called a tree collar. I love them. I'm not sure that I will have the print facing forward. I liked it just for the galvanized look of it. So I'm gonna try to get the stickers off and probably just use it from that side. But my goodness, for a dollar, that is awesome. And they seem pretty, you know, pretty wide. So, so cool. Uh, I don't even know where to start, guys. You should see the stuff on this table. It's insane. They have had a ton of movies out lately and I quick skimmed through them and I actually found a Christmas one. And it is called A Christmas Star. I've never seen this before. And it says, Prepare to Believe in Miracles. And it has Robert James Collier, Brana Waugh, Richard Clements, with Pierce Brosnan and Liam Neeson in it. I've never seen this movie before. So I picked it up. I love Christmas movies. I picked it up for us to watch and see what we think. If you guys have seen that, let me know. Is it cute? So we picked up that one. That was the only Christmas movie in the, it, it was right up front when you walk in where they have kind of like their deal of the day or deal of the week. They just had tons of videos. They had a bunch of new gift tags. This is from the Christmas house gift tags. You get 18 pieces in here. And I just thought these were really pretty. And I don't know if you're gonna be able to see very well, but they are kind of a 3D, 3D effect to them. So there's nine there and the same on the back. But I just thought they were so pretty, the blues and whites and silvers, which probably won't go with any of the other stuff that I got this year to, to wrap and bag up and everything with, but I just, I couldn't pass them up. I thought they were so nice. So I just picked up one pack of those. And then they had these big gift tags. And they do come with the silver strings that you can put through the hole to attach. And I thought those were very nice. And these are these are pretty big guys. They're probably at least three and a half inches tall, maybe four inches tall. They're a nice size. And it's from the it says to and from on the back. And the red one says do not open until December 25th and it's kind of a foil, and then the silver with the, the green Christmas tree, it is glitter. It is silver glitter on there. So I thought those were very nice and very different. And you get 16 pieces in here, so you must get eight of each. And these were the only style of these that I saw. So I just picked up one pack of each of those. They had some more gift bags, and I believe I'm good well I have a couple big ones here but I think then I am good on the big size gift bags but I knew that I needed some smaller so I picked up this and it's a two pack and I thought it looked very different oh look it's my blue it'll go with those labels but I saw peace and that's the reason I picked this up was because it said peace and it is foiled if you can see that the blue is foil just a nice little gift bag that's the print on the sides has the blue handle and then the kind of peachy gold color is not foiled at all and it says hope and they also do have the little two 
to and from tag that you would have to you know write it yourself on but this one says hope a very different color that that peachy gold color I thought was very different so I just grabbed one pack of these to have I have a few smaller gifts that I need bags for they also had out a ton everything's just gonna fall off this table if you would see this table it's insane they had some of their gift boxes out I don't know if these are new for this year or if they were from last year I have no idea but on this is what caught my eye on this side it says peace with the green leaf and the the um border around the piece is gold foil and I just thought that was so pretty and simple on the neutral box like the natural looking box it says two pieces gift box by Christmas house but this one says peace and this on the back is the stocking with the greenery and the red is foiled also the neutral box I really like these I just think they're so they're so simple and just classy so I did get two of those. All right, let's see, which way do I go here so everything doesn't fall off? I'm gonna show these real quick because they're just dangling here. They have the LED projector lights out again. And the, I got these for the two older granddaughter, grandladies last year and they really liked them. So I got these and this one is Santa in his sleigh flying across the sky. And this one is a snowman. It kind of looks like a um, like a snow globe type scene. So I picked up these. I know they really enjoyed them last year, so I picked those up for them. And I think I may have mentioned in one of my videos or in an upcoming video, we play a game when we go up for um, the be beginning of, of December. We go up and we have what we call Thanks Hunt Miss. And it's a combination get together for Thanksgiving, hunting, and Christmas. And that's when we take our gifts and everything for them. We play a game, and I, I don't even know how to describe it, but you, you play with dice. Everybody starts off with a gift that they don't know what it is. I do because I'm buying, I guess. And you kind of take your turn going around the table and throwing the dice, and you can steal people's gifts. And if you land on a certain number, it'll say, like, everybody move their gift right or everybody move their gift left. So you never know what gift you're gonna end up with at the end. And these I'm gonna wrap up to play that game with because they really did enjoy them last year. So that's what those are for. I'm gonna show these gift bags to get them off my lap. I got just three more big gift bags and I, I think I'm good then. I'm gonna stay away from the gift bags unless something really catches my eye. But this one says, cut your own Christmas tree farm or it says cut your own own and then it says Christmas tree farm and it says pine fir cedar spruce this is not foiled anywhere very simple kind of a ship lap looking background on it I really enjoyed this I don't know what it is about me with this look this year with the Christmas trees and I just love it and it has the white handle let me see what the sides are uh, cool like red and black flannel sides so I just picked up one of those and right beside it were these and they were so very similar that at first I almost didn't even realize that they were different. This one says pick your own Christmas trees, fresh cut, fresh delivery. This has the little red truck on it with the pine tree on the back and kind of snowflakes and winter scene. And it also has a red and black on the sides. And this has more like a shoelace, red shoelace type handles. But I thought that was really nice. And right beside it, and I almost didn't notice, but they had this one. And this one says, the original Christmas farm shop, trees, ornaments, and candy. And it has the barn with the same winter background, the Christmas trees. I thought those were so nice. So I just picked up one of each of these and now I think I am good with bags and I have to take all this stuff and put it away they have all of their little fake I don't know what you even call these things they're like bottle brush Christmas trees out so many to choose from I'm gonna have to move some of this stuff out of the way here so I can get to them all 
hubby, I think I've mentioned it many times, he has a train layout in the basement. And last year he actually gave the grandkids their own trains and a lot of houses and things like that to have their own little train layouts. So we picked up some of these stay here for him on the train layout. Some of them are for me to use to decorate with. And some of them are gonna go to the grandkids for their train layout. But their trees this year were just so pretty. They had, I don't even know how many colors they had with the gold garland, several. So we got some gold ones, we got some green ones, and I'm not even showing you all of them. I picked one of each, and I think there's like two more sets of the trees downstairs. They also have these. They have the solid white. That's gonna be very hard to show, but it does have silver, a silver bead garland running through it, and they had it in blue with these silver garland and they do bend. These are kind of all bent out of shape from being in the back, but they do bend and straighten out very nice. But the trees this year are just stunning. Then they had some with little, little ornaments and we got one in the white and one in the green and it's like flock tipped. Just thought those were so cute. And then they had all of these. Can you see that, how it's kind of layered? They had it in white. I believe they had it in green, but we didn't get any of those. They had them in gold and they had them in pink. So we got several of those. Just so nice this year. I just absolutely love it. So some of those are gonna be used in my Christmas decorating and I'm just gonna go ahead and pitch these on the floor. Oh my goodness, guys. We couldn't pass them up though. The store that we found all of these in, people were scooping them up. It's, I wondered why there was like three people in this, congregated in this one area and when I looked over, there was just boxes of them and the one lady probably had 40 in her cart. So I figured we better grab them while they're there. And Hubby picked up these little LED wire lights and it says you get two pieces on there. And I hope you can see it. I believe they're little candy canes. Let me look on here and see what are they? Yes, they are little candy canes on, on the ends. That's gonna be very hard for me to show, but they are little candy canes on there. So I don't know what he got these for. If they're for the train set, or for him to give to the grandkids for their train sets. I'm not I'm not quite sure, but he picked up one of those. Oh my gosh. And then he got them a whole bunch of the little figurines. He got this one and it looks like it's a mailman with the mailbox and the little Christmas tree. He got this one that has a little boy and it looks like the dad with wood and a wagon full. And I believe they're supposed to be logs, but kind of looks like black, like coal, but he picked up that one. He picked up this one with Santa and a snowman and the sign that says North Pole. I can't even read it because it's so small. Candyland Lane, Santa's Workshop, Reindeer Stables. He got that one. And then he got this. It's just a little bench with two little light posts. And then he got this one. And actually the manager of the store, she's like, you need to see this one. And she dug through the whole way to the back off of the, the peg to dig out this one for him with the little red truck and the pull behind camper. And the truck has a little Christmas tree in it. So he got a pack of that. Then he also got some of these. Um, this is also by Christmas House and it's the LED light set. They are battery operated and it has 10 lights and he got them all in clear white and they did have other colors, I believe red and green. And these are the little, little LED string lights. He got, I think he got three or four packs of these. So I'm not quite sure what he's doing with those, but I'm sure there's a method to his madness. And these I got as well to put for the game that we play when I go to my daughter's house. And it's just the little snow globe. And then this one says joy on the front and it's a little gnome. 
It's supposed to be Santa, I think, but he looks more like a gnome to me. So I got two of these to wrap up his gifts. Let me see. Oh, there's another one of the, the candy cane lights. They had all of these little, little art things for kids to do. And this one, it's by Crafter Square, and it comes with the paints and the paintbrush. And it's a you paint little, the little rock, and it says Elf Squad on it. And I thought that was really cute. So I picked up a couple of these for the game. And it's very heavy. It's like it's made out of cement. It's definitely not a rock, but it, it's made out of cement to make it look like a rock. So I thought that was really cute. Let me see, what else is there? For the little train sets and things, they have all their little houses out. And this one is cobblestone candy. Just the detail in these just blows my mind for a dollar. There's a little wreath on the door. And there's little spires on, I think they're, I don't know what they are, but whatever you call those, on the roof. And just so cute. And these are, you use these with the little battery operated rated LED lights and there is a hole under there with a big warning not to use it with flame or whatever, but so, so cute. So we got, we got two of the candy shop. He got two of, I guess this is just somebody's beautiful home. He got two of these. He got two of the Toy Village. That is a toy store, I believe. So nice. This one even has a little side door. And then two of the churches. But so nice. And I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna see if putting this in, if you guys can see the light. Can you see the light shining through in there? I hope you can. It's really hard with the lights in here are so bright, so it's probably hard for you to see, but you put the little LED candle in there and it really does shine through. It's, it's hard to show you though, so I apologize for that, but they work very nice. <clears throat> so we picked up those. Then they had all these little wooden, little wooden things. And this is also by Crafter Square. And this is a little gingerbread house. I thought I would wrap it up as well for the game. And it has the little, I guess I need to pull the thing out. It has the little, same as this, the little LED candle in there. And it just lights up. And I thought if you know, one of the kids, if they would win this as their prize with the game, they could decorate it, make a little cute gingerbread house out of it. So I picked that up. Then I have a few ornaments. Oh, and one more thing. Let's show this first. I found this mug. <laughs> Look at the size of that. Nice, nice size mug. And it says, let's get cozy. And it's a, looks like a cup of hot chocolate with marshmallows in it. Very nice size mug. And the print is on both sides. This is the first Christmas winter type mug that I have seen come out so far at the Dollar Tree. And this one, I would keep it out all year round, not just at Christmas time. So I love that and just picked up one, a few ornaments, and then that's it for this haul. They had these. They have the little buck. It's kind of like a burlap looking fabric and the red kind of, um, I don't know what you would call that, kind of velour feeling little red buck on them. I thought they were really cute. So I just, I picked up one pack of those. Have no idea what I'm doing with this but I thought they were adorable, so I picked up one. I have so much glitter on me, guys, I can feel it when I touch my legs. They had these ornaments as well, and it's very hard to see that, but it does say peace, and it has the black and white buffalo check with the little greenery, but it says peace, so of course, me with peace, I, I picked that up. Just cute. And then they had these funky little things. Aren't they adorable? These are by Christmas House, you get two. They are like little fluffy, it almost looks like it would be feathers, but it is not. At least I don't think so. Let me take a closer look. No, it's not feathers, but it looks like it would be feathers with little iridescent sequins on it. I thought those were so cute. 
So I picked up a pack of those to show you. They're adorable. And right beside those, they had these little white. This one I, I'm gonna have to fix. I see a piece of yarn hanging down, but they're just little balls with almost like a white chenille yarn wrapped around them. I love them. So I picked those up. And that'll probably be it for the ornaments that I pick up this year. Every year I do try to pick up just a couple of their ornaments to add to my tree. So I thought those were really cute and different, so I grabbed those. So anyway, guys, this video is already over 20 minutes long. That's it for what I have picked up in the last two weeks for, for Christmas. I, I'm loving what they're bringing out, but I need to slow down. So anyway, guys, you guys, if you appreciate this video, you appreciate my content, please subscribe. I'd love to have you as part of my YouTube family. You guys are the best and you mean the world to me. I'm going to get off of here and get this all put away. Have a great day, everybody. And I'm going to talk to you again really soon. Peace.